Hi, I'm the Lock Picking Cuba, and in this video I'm going to have a look at the Hokey Cokey Lock from TwoBrassMonkeys.com. I got this from Etsy, and on the card it says, Thank you for buying from our Etsy store. For the latest news on our puzzles, information on how to care for them, and hints, tips, or solutions, see reverse of this card. So I'm hoping I won't need to check out this uh, um, website for hints or tips, because I'm hoping I'll be able to figure it out myself. So I opened up the box once just to have a look and see if there were any instructions that I needed to follow, and I couldn't see any. But other than that, I haven't uh, looked at the lock or checked it out. So here we go. It is a pretty standard looking padlock. So I'm guessing that it's a padlock that's been modified to turn it into a puzzle. It's got um, Hokey Cokey written on there. And can we just take a second to appreciate this name? Um, I'm assuming that solving this puzzle is gonna involve putting something in and taking something out and shaking it all about, in which case uh, that name really will be genius. But even if not, it's got key in it, you know, as in key. So that's pretty cool. Okay, and it comes with, well, it comes with two keys and it comes with this bottle opener. I don't know whether the bottle opener is part of the solution or not. All right, so. Let's have a look. We have this. It says the Hokey Cokey Lock, twobrassmonkeys.com, and it seems like a pretty standard bottle opener. Um, I think it's made of metal. And we have this uh, key ring with two keys on. I'm going to start out assuming that you aren't meant to like pull the ring apart or anything like that. Um, but, well, let's just do the obvious thing. Of course, it's always possible that the key will go in and get stuck, but let's see. Okay, the key fits in, nothing happens, can't open it, oh good, <laughs> the key came out, that's a relief. Um, now, I am tempted by this little hole here, but again I'm going to start by assuming I'm not meant to damage this ring and stick it in the hole, although hokey cokey, hmm, put it in and take it out, I don't know. Let's see. Shake it all about. Okay, I can't hear anything or feel anything rattling around in there. Now, there are two keys, which is interesting. I wonder if they're identical or not. Ooh, they're not. That's interesting. Okay. That's that key. What about the other key? So they're very similar to each other in terms of the bitting, but not quite the same. Right here, I guess that's the only difference. Now why would you need two keys? Having two keys is Kind of annoying because it feels like anything I do with one of them, I have to then also do with the other one just in case. Mm. Okay, it's been seven minutes so far and I think I've made no progress at all. Other than realizing that the keys are different. Okay, one piece of progress. Do I pay any attention to the bottle opener? It's hard to see how it could be useful, really. I'm really 
me wondering about whether I'm supposed to put this in there. Um, okay, well, I mean, no harm in trying, right? Let's see what happens. I can replace this ring if I need to. is the key and the ring at the same time. <laughs> I think I'm clutching at straws here. No, okay. I think the ring is a red herring and I think this is probably a red herring too. Mm, just check it's not magnetic or something. Magnets, I guess. Hmm. Okay, let's look at these on top of each other now. Yeah, really very similar, apart from at the back of the keyway. Why would that be useful? You can't put them both in at the same time. I mean, I can put one in and then the other one in. Oh, maybe that's the idea somehow. Yeah, I guess you have to put one in. How does the song go? Put your right arm in, your right arm out, in, out, in, out, shake it all about. Mm. I assume I'm not meant to use this card. It's just marketing, right? Uh, 13 minutes and 30 something seconds now since the video started and I think I've eliminated some things I don't think these are anything to do with it and I know that the keys are different from each other and apart from that I don't think I know anything <laughs> there can't possibly be a join that I can't see here and then ah oh, look at that okay <clears throat> is this the end <laughs> I guess that's it is that it so the, oh wait that comes out as well you can see where I scratched it with the chain there. I guess that's it. There's nothing more to it. The keys are a complete red herring, I think. Um, so I think that that means it's a completely normal functioning padlock. 
but just with part of the shackle unscrewing. Oh, right. Yeah, and there's nothing for the locking lug here to lock into on this bit of the shackle. <laughs> that is very clever. Look at this. I don't know if you can see the join there. I can see it now, actually, that I'm looking for it. Um, but it took me <laughs> six, 16 minutes to find that. Let's have a look. Does this just go back in? Yeah. Now, why? The question is, why was this released? Oh, I see. It wasn't. I just was able to twist it out. <laughs> sort of self-shimming padlock, I guess. Wow, that is very, very cool. Now, the last time I did a padlock puzzle, I regretted not having a go at picking it open. So I'm going to try that now. Let's see. All right. Let's have a look. Let's try top of the keyway first. So the last puzzle lock that I uh, solved, I picked it open afterwards. And I think it only had two pins in. I think that the, uh, because the solution actually involved the key, the, uh, the creator modified the internals of the lock. I don't know if that's going to be the case here. I mean, there's no reason for them to need to do it, but... Wow, so all that business with two different keys was just a red herring as well. Completely irrelevant, I guess. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that took a while. Okay, it is pickable then. <laughs> okay, there we go. So that was um, Two Brass Monkeys Hokey Cokey Lock, uh, which was very good fun. I love the uh, red herrings. I'm going to have to replace that. But that's okay. I love the fact that you have these two keys that are similar but just slightly different from each other which makes you think there's some sequential especially given the name of the lock ah hokey cokey lock ah, that was very clever all right that's a very cool uh, padlock puzzle um hope you've enjoyed this video if you have please uh, click the like button or subscribe if you haven't already subscribed all right thanks so much for watching